The last part is to decide exactly how the thumb should approach the bow and what angle. If I go too far under, I risk clamping on the bow, leading to tension and lack of ability to play expressively. More importantly, with my thumb underneath, I will most certainly want to press up, which is going to take the bow off the string and counteract all the weight I am trying to get into the bow, which is the exact opposite of what I want to happen. If I put the thumb on top to help the weight go down into the stick, I have no control. I am unable to hold it in any kind of fashion that will allow me to do all the things I need to do. Those highs and lows and extremes, the expressive playing and music making that make playing cello so awesome. So a happy middle, a compromise in between becomes the best option. The thumb going into the stick, not under, not on top, is the best position for the thumb to be in coming into the bow. This allows the thumb to be flexible and help hold the bow with supple strength and to direct the weight of the arm into the bow.